Hello everybody, it's the Dr. Goof and I wanted to make a quick little video to demonstrate how you can create a fire breathing dragon. Okay, the first thing I want to do, I would like to get rid of the sprite that I have currently here. I'm going to right click on the cat. I'm going to delete that. Go down to new sprite. I'm going to look down in here. I believe there's a dragon with two costumes. Let's see if one of these costumes is actually breathing fire. Click on it, add that sprite. Now I can look at the dragon and it has two costumes. One is breathing fire right here. The other one is not. Okay, all I want to do here, I, I, this is just part of a solution, but this is just one trick to get your dragon to breathe fire. Let's go add an event here. When this flag is clicked, then what we want to do, we want to set up a forever control loop. And inside here, we really only want to do two things. We want to change the costume, and then we want to wait for a little bit. Uh, the first thing we're going to do, we are going to, I think this is still in control. We're going to wait one second, and then we are going to go back into looks, and we are going to switch costume. We'll just go next costume. Since there's only two costumes, we're going to switch back and forth. I'm going to move the dragon into the middle of the screen a little bit. Now I'm going to click the green flag, and our dragon should alternate between breathing fire and not breathing fire. Anyhow, that is just the quick little video of how you can get a fire-breathing dragon in Scratch. Thank you for watching.